y'all welcome back to my channel i hope that you are having an amazing day today i'm going to be showing y'all how to style your twa getting it from this to this so first you're going to start off on some freshly washed and detangled hair i use this cream of nature conditioner to wash my hair you're also going to want a denim brush for detangling your hair and for styling you're going to want some oil i love using olive oil and i put it in this little bottle just so it's easier to put on so the first thing that you're going to do is put that oil into your hands rub it between your palms and then work that into your scalp oil doesn't moisturize your hair but it locks in moisture that's already there so it's really important to do this on hair that is already wet or damp to keep your hair as healthy as possible Next, I'm going to use my Cream of Nature Twisting Cream. It can be any cream, but I just really like this one. It really smells good and keeps my hair moisturized. Same thing, rub that between your hands and work that first into your scalp and then into the rest of your hair. You don't need to get too much of this um, onto the ends of your hair because you don't want it to show up super white after you style it. And add this next product, which is Lotta Body Wrap Me Foaming Mousse. If y'all can guess what song I am singing to in this clip, I will shout you out in the next video. The hint is the artist's name starts with a J. The featured artist's name. The actual artist's name starts with a W. So you're just going to spray some of that mousse into your hand. And then starting at the top of your hair this time, not the scalp, you're going to start rubbing that in with your palms into your hair. And after you rub that in a good amount, you're going to switch to using your fingertips to work it in in small circular motions. And this will help to create small curls that you'll see throughout your head and define the curls that you do have. So as you can see, working that in with your fingertips really does allow the curls to come through and you're just going to keep doing that same process throughout your head. This step does take a lot of mousse, but the Lotta Body Foaming Mousse really does get the job done and it's cheaper than a lot of other mousses that you'll find in stores. Sometimes after I finish working around my head, I like to just go back to the front and add a little bit more of the mousse just to make sure I get the front of my head really defined. So this is what my hair looks like after that. If I feel like spicing it up a little bit, I will also do my edges um, just to add a little bit to the style. I like using Cream of Nature Extra Firm Hold. I really like Cream of Nature if y'all can't tell, as well as an edge brush. So the first thing that you're going to do is just brush your edges away from um, the rest of your hairline just so that way you don't get that edge control mixed in with your hair. You're going to take a little bit of edge control and lay it onto your edges just to slick it down. Ooh, and the camera fell. Okay, we're back. So you're going to just slick your hair down with that edge control and repeat those two steps on the other side of your head. Next, you're going to take your edge brush and from the topmost part, just start creating swoops out of the line of slick down hair. Usually I do like three, two and a half swoops per side, um, but you're just going to do that on each side like so. Next, you're going to wash your hands because you don't want that edge gel in the hair that you added the mousse to and then you're going to just mess with the front of your hairline so that way it kind of blends in with the edges and it doesn't look too separated or weird then you can take your edge brush and go back through and do any touch-ups that you feel are needed to bring the style together 
and that's it. So it is a little bit white right now, as you can see, but no worries, it will dry clear. So I will see y'all when the hair is dry. All right, y'all, so I am back. My hair is dry, my makeup is done, and this is the final look. My hair is 4C type, so like the curls aren't super defined. The edges aren't super defined, but just by like taking the time to take care of your hair, the look will look neater like throughout the day. I love, love, love having short hair. Like it was so easy um, to put this together. And when you take care of like everything, the look comes together. I know sometimes when people are thinking about cutting their hair, they're scared of losing their femininity. If anything, I feel more of myself with my hair short. So I'm actually going to be making a video about why I cut my hair. Um, I'm gonna make it the next time I cut my hair because I'm about to go out of my comfort zone, really far out of my comfort zone. But it should be exciting. But when I do do that, I will be making a video about why I cut my hair. So if you have any questions that you would like me to answer in that video, leave them in the comments below so I can think about them while I'm putting that together. But I really hope that y'all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.